So there is a big change coming for four CMS schools and it affects over 1700 students. The CMS school board voted to revert back to a regular school calendar instead of having a year round schedule for these schools. NBC Charlotte's Rob Hughes now on why CMS is making this change. The consensus is this continuous learning calendar is not providing any academic benefit for the students who attend those four schools. However, it's not a simple task just changing back to a regular schedule and its impact will be felt by more than just the students. Four Charlotte Mecklenburg magnet schools on the city's west side are failing, according to parents. I understand why the CLC was voted in five years ago. It makes perfect sense on paper. We just haven't seen any academic gains from it. The schedule change will be instituted in the coming school year. The four schools currently on the continuous learning calendar are Bruns Elementary, Walter G. Byers, Thomasboro Academy, and Druid Hills Academy. Reading is level to traditional schools at best, and then math is far lower. The continuous learning schedule is also costly to run, $830,000 per school year. While a schedule change could benefit 1,700 students, teachers and staff at the four schools will likely miss the July pay period as a result. I think our staff um, work extraordinarily hard for low pay, and I think it's not kind of us to pull a rug out under from under them at the last minute. And according to CMS superintendent Dr. Clayton Wilcox, in many cases, the staff at these schools are some of the district's lowest paid employees in West Charlotte. Rob Hughes, NBC Charlotte.